This week, Twitter updated its micro video sharing app, Vine, with the ability to take front facing video. Uh, and in addition to just like taking pictures with the front face camera, you can switch back and forth. So you can take a picture of yourself and then switch it back and then take a picture of your friends off in the distance. Ooh, a bird. Yeah, that's my sister's parrot. Oh, wow. Exciting. So Kobo has a brand new limited edition premium e-reader. It's called the Aura. HD. Ooh. Now, it's premium because it has a really great screen. This is the best screen on the market. Let me it's, check this out. It's pretty dope, as the kids say. The glow is incredibly well managed. The contrast is great, and you can adjust the font, so you can make them a little bit thicker. You can adjust the weight. So if you're a huge, hardcore e-reader fan, this is a great e-reader. When I first heard about this, I was really you know, kind of mad okay. about it, but this screen is really probably the most fantastic e-reader screen that I've I've seen. Now, in addition to redesigning the screen and making it awesome, they've also changed the case. Now, that might not be so awesome. They've they've added these sort of little mountains, these little peaks on the back, which is nice if you're right-handed, but if you're left-handed and you have small hands, it, it, it might, you know, be a little slippery because it still has that slick back. Are you vining? I'm vining you right now. It does have the problem of the Amazon ecosystem, which is huge, and of course Kobo doesn't work with that, only the Kindle works with the Amazon ecosystem. So if you're a hardcore reader and you're part of Kobo's ecosystem, awesome. But if you're still part of Amazon, you really love those Kindle singles, and you're a Prime user, and you like having those free, uh, those free books to check out, then it's kind of a tough sell. Ooh.